After the discovery of uh, Dr. Castro, that fine medical specialist that we have discovered, I really just need to find a linebacker coach. I figured a perfect time to do this today would be right here in the hot tub. You know what I've discovered is Linda wants to take everything from me and I helped pay for half of this. She has had the hot tub for uh, 500 days now, which means that I have banked up about 250 days in this hot tub. And today, I'm gonna try and get about 200% of my peas into this hot tub in time. All right, everybody. I'm gonna start calling you guys back one by one for interviews individually. But before we get started, I gotta ask a question. Who signed their name as an X? That was me, Newbert. Why? I didn't want Coach to know I was here. All right, yeah, man. Well, uh, yeah, you. Infinity Stone. Let's go. Come on, Pat. You can do it. I believe in you. It is such an honor, first of all. All right. Let's go, Coach. Hop ahead, bro. Right on. No! Damn it, Shane, you are not coming in this hot tub. Oh, you're not getting in this hot Shane, do not get in this hot tub. Once this, I get in the hot tub, the interview starts. No, you're not getting an interview. I've told you nine times you're not on the coaching staff. What more interview do you need? All right, J316, you're up, man. Hey, coach. Buzz. How are you? I'm a little warm. I've been in the hot tub for like two hours now yeah, yeah, um, yeah. do you want to get into the hot tub no 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 not really a water guy much more a fire guy not be a good football coach Shane I, okay what kind of scheme would you run a scheme I'd run like a scheme where all the kids have brass knuckles they just fucking deck all the other kids linebackers really speaks out to me just the way they move so like a normal person, they can move forward and backwards, and that just speaks yes, to you. Yes, or um, Pat, can like you a, not like move a, forward and backwards or side to side? Not, I mean, I'm, after puberty, I could. Buzz, let me ask you this question: yeah. What are you willing to do for the team? Anything, Coach. I just really need a reason to get out of the house right now. There's nothing going on in there. I'll do the side. Okay. Do that. It's here. Yeah. Can you see it? Things have not gone according to your plan, I'm I assuming. There we oh, go. Oh, there we go. It's a little wet. Shane, I mean, water. you have single-handedly taken up 90% of this hot tub. Woo! <laughs> I'm floating. <Water. laughs> I, um, you are making me real uncomfortable. What? How are we related? How are we related? Yes. Your mom is my aunt. Stupid fuck. Do you see the intensity? In my eyes, I haven't blinked, not once. Not gun, not fit. Nope, you've now talked about chest pad. That's a big turn off. This is no pain. Game, we are not six anymore. We are not looking at each other's penises. I want to thank you for coming in, Pat. And, uh, you know, I'm, okay. That's you just that's did nice. Did so uh, much to me. Later. Oh, God. Please get me out of, no. get out of my hot tub, Shane. No. No. You're no. out of the hot tub. So it's, it's a no, uh, no then. No, You're no. not on my coaching staff, and you hurt my feelings. I don't need this shit. I'm going on a nature walk. Shane, I... Shane, pull your pants up! No. His aunt is going to be so embarrassed when she sees this. God, my mom is going to call me on the phone. I haven't talked to her in like three years. That son of a bitch. Yes. No! You are not hired! You are not even close to You're not even in consideration. Get out of here. Bullshit. And uh, I guess that makes you bark. So they call me. I was pretty surprised when I saw that you were on the list of people interviewing. I did not realize you had any interest in football whatsoever. I feel like I could probably learn a lot from you. That's a good answer. That's the best answer I've heard all day. Okay, uh, what schematically would you like to do? A 3-4 or a 4-3? Um, well, fractions are not my strong suit. That sounds like SEC talk if I've ever heard it. Well, Barb, I, I gotta be honest with you. You've been the first person who has come to this interview process today and made any sense. And you have not threatened me or tried to hug me at any point. No, sir. It's not my style. So, uh... Coach! What the hell are you doing? Oh, shit! Burn rubber, Barb! 
I have papers. Half of the hot tubs I have. They've done 250. What the hell are you doing with these weirdos? What the hell are you doing? This is what my job is. Do you not understand? Interviews and why do you need water to do interviews? Because that that makes you look cooler. Damn, that was impressive. Oh. Marlon, that should have been you. So Tanner, I'm sorry you have to, uh, you know, hear your mom and I fight all the time. <laughs> she just loves to yell at me and, well, I have terrible taste in women, so. Yeah, it's hard being a single mom. Never thought I'd have to be one, exactly. How'd, uh, how, how's school starting this semester? Uh, pretty good. Good. Uh, you know, you're, you're making new, you're making any new friends or anything like that? Yeah, a little bit. Any relationships with women or anything? I don't date. I'm not looking for women. You know, that's not a bad thing. Honestly, that could be pretty good. This just kind of stuff, huh? can't really do fix the talking. Uh, have time for myself. I hate to admit it, but that suits of armor and shit that he's into. That's kinda cool. And a waterbed and he had some fun on that. He's a pretty cool dude, I guess. Don't tell myself that. One time I was doing this operation and we were really down on the wire. But it was Valentine's Day and um, so I was operating on this guy and um, I heard some yelling behind me and it sounded like coach and sure enough he was barking his way into the room and he got in there and burst through the doors and brought me these flowers and they were so big and pretty but uh, yeah he kind of knocked over the table and, um, and it kind of distracted me and I, kind of snapped his wiener off. Not coaches, the, the guy. Um, it was a vasectomy, so. Um, he died. I won't forget that Valentine's Day, though. Catch me some dinner now. If it hadn't been, if it hadn't been 